Now, in other news, the Korean government has unveiled a five-year plan to tackle the overuse and misuse of antibiotics in the nation. The move comes, as studies show, lots of doctors in Korea are prescribing antibiotics for ailments as mild as the common cold. Kim Jong-soo has more. The Korean government will launch a five-year plan starting in 2016 to combat the growing issue of the so-called superbacteria or an emerging strain of bacteria that have become antibiotic resistant. The decision came during a meeting chaired by Prime Minister Hwang Kyo-won on Thursday. Antibiotics are essential for the prevention and treatment of infectious diseases, but frequent abuse has resulted in the growth of antibiotic resistant bacteria. This poses a significant threat to national health security and is a global problem as well. Health experts generally do not recommend the use of antibiotics for treating the common cold. However, prescription rates to treat such illness were as high as 73% in 2002 and stood at 45% as of 2015. Seoul plans to reduce the general rate of antibiotic prescriptions for all diseases by 20% within the next five years. Korea's antibiotic usage rate for every 1,000 people was 35% higher than the average of 12 other OECD nations. This has resulted in an alarmingly high rate of superbacteria. The government's new five-year plan will further encourage medical institutions to reduce their prescription of antibiotics by offering a higher tax benefit to those with significantly lower prescription rates. The plan will also look to develop more experts in the field of antibiotics. The government will also launch educational campaigns targeting the public to help illustrate the proper use of antibiotics. Kim Jong-soo. Arirang News.